Dynamite planted. Medic. Medic. Watch it. Objective taken.
Dynamite planted. Dynamite planted. Aborted. Can't see target. Only five minutes, soldier.
my way. A welcome one and all to H2K TV. We, we pulled out here, we are seeing our reactions as well. So we're going to bring you the game up. Uh, yeah man, it should be a pretty good game. Uh, we're just watching the second round of the first map, which is Gold Rush. We've got uh, Overload defending now against the Farmer. Side, the two lineups, if you uh, aren't watching, obviously. Uh, for the Axis Overload side, we've got Mouse, Cherry, Jerry, Yo, Quake and Antho. Uh, it looks like a pretty well to be honest we've seen as we just joined just trying to get all the uh, shoutcast uh, you know up and ready and got all the sound work and all that it looks like it's been a full hold at the tank stage after the overload side obviously have set a reasonably strong time on the first map gold rush just cut a couple of grenades spam here at the side entrance as the farmer side try and make their way in with an ng and two more medics coming in now kawaii is going to be the ng he's going to go down to a grenade but he's going to get instantly revived by kiji his teammate there and now there's quite a lot of farmers players in this side entrance i don't think it's actually doable anymore the map as anyway leo gets a couple of back route frags there at the side entrance cleans out that side attack and quake is there as a medic he's not going to revive the engineer he's going to get the two medics up but he's going to he's going to go down himself to cherry as well and they're going to definitely go down off the uh, overload respawn and uh, yeah, it's Denied. not looking too good for the farmer side at the moment. Yeah, rough luck there and the push failing uh, terribly, terribly. Uh, you know, they got close there, but couldn't quite pull it off in the end. So we're gonna have to see uh, how, how they do next wave. Indeed, possibly one of the favorites in my opinion to uh, take this event. Yes, this the is the second day of groups, so uh, you know these. these uh, with uh, the group setup, this is the first uh, day these groups actually uh, get to play. We started a few hours ago, so you guys didn't miss much in these groups at least. Uh, and we're happy to bring you guys some ET action. Of course, I'm on the mic. Like uh, Marta and Mumbles, I was also the COD caster, if you guys have been tuning in for quite a while. Uh, I used to play ET really, really back in the day, but uh, you know we're going to see how, how this goes. and. Uh, we're just going to provide you with as many as much ET action as we can. Honest, and uh, this is definitely a full hold for the overload side at uh, the tank stage, and I think it's fair to say any team that can do that is pretty impressive. So uh, I've, I've got a good feeling that overload are going to take this game four 0 Yeah, they're, they're taking this much risk, even pushing out this far. This is just quite a. It just says a lot. Indeed. Oh, careful there. <laughs> <laughs> Medic going to nice uh, chip frog. a couple of the mines there, even though there is. Oh, there's an engineer on it. They're going to probably get the uh, the build. They're not going to get any of the rest of the objectives done because there's 40 seconds left on the clock. Good game overload, to be honest. I know we missed it all because we were setting up the shoutcast. So uh, hopefully we'll bring the entire the second uh, the second map. And hopefully that map should be uh, you know pretty interesting, pretty tight game, hopefully. Hopefully we can take it to a third map as well. Do you know what the, the setup is for this tournament? This is the best of three? Uh, I know that there are no draws in the groups, okay. I can tell you that much, so they have to play three, you, you have to have a winner basically at the end of the year. Oh, uh, then we could be here for quite, quite a while. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, you never know. Hopefully we won't be, because uh, yeah, we well, need to we'll showcase we'll Speed Link and Rocket as well after this game. And that is going to be a group decided match for the people that don't actually know. So yeah, game over. Good match. Allies couldn't beat the clock, unfortunate for them. Looking at the stats, we see that Mouse uh, did, did quite well for himself. Uh, gotta say, honestly, the Overlord team seems, uh, of course, <laughs> very down in this half with uh, with the kill count, but that's kind of uh, obvious, <laughs> you know, with with uh, with their full hold. So we're gonna have to see if uh, how things go from here on out. I don't actually know what the second map is though, so we're in for a bit of a surprise here. Well, I they might just replay this one. I hope they don't replay this one. Uh, let's hope not. <laughs> That would not be the nicest of There we go. Oh, Adler now. Adler now. Bit of a so called Lotto map, but uh, I think it's just. You just gotta be good at it. It's not Lotto. I see, well. I guess that's the difference between you and me as a, <laughs> as a level of ET player. So I, I think the, the randomness on this map is quite, quite great. <laughs> <laughs> see, a lot of people say that this is a random map, but, well. Well, we're gonna have to see how it pans out for these two teams. You know, uh, uh, with with a full hold on both sides on this first map, I don't think they're that far apart to, to really make a huge difference on this map either. So, you know, if, right now, if 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 you know, just to say, if you know, say one team gets a, a decisive advantage over the other team, 
It's an opposite that makes a, a quite quite a good statement for it being quite quite random because we saw these teams are quite quite close. Yeah, indeed, and this is the second map, which is Adelanest. Awesome. And we have gone, we're ready to rock with Leo starting off with the Panzer on the middle two boxes there. Heavy push from the hatchway, though, with a couple of the Famas guys. Two engineers are there with a couple of medics in support. They're going to just chuck a couple of nades over, hopefully get a couple of frags, just so they can uh, clear the way to get the dynamite down. Uh, engineer Jerry pushing now, going to get a grenade frag, along with Leo as well. Two couple of frags there. Kawhi's going to go in with, as an engineer, nade spam coming into the door controls. They know he's over there. The engineer's jumped in, he's been taken down, and the rifles have gone as well to Mouse. Well played there from Mouse, just as the, uh, just as the engineer jumps in. I think they had it on lockdown. A Leo Panzer Faust here at the boxes as well. Just off, I think just off the spawn as the uh, rest of the other guys come jumping through the main there. Another push through the hatch though with an engineer yeah. and a medic, Kiji and Kawhi. Nice nade there from Yoke though. Is he going to stop the uh, stop the plant? I'm not sure if he is. There's uh, two engineers there. They're going to get the plant on the door controls, and that's a good starter for the uh, for the farmer side. Can they uh, hold this defuse? For, for those of uh, for, for the viewers not very uh, familiar with ET, what's uh, the stages on this map? Can you go over it real quick? Uh, well, this well, this is Safe if one, I'm honest, yeah. uh, it's, this most not of the time this is going to be a quick map. But uh, as I said before, this is definitely going to be a diffuse as oh. well from Overload. That's not the best of things uh, for the farmer side, and we're loving we're loving the disco mid cast, aren't we? That is exactly what we wanted there. <laughs> Right, but either way though, for the people that are still tuned in, hopefully you can't hear that too loud, like, but uh, we'll just have to put up with it for now. Another dynamite going down on the door controls as the farmer side, I think they've just secured this uh, first stage. But uh, yeah, hopefully they'll uh, sort the DJ yeah, out. Not enough time to, to get a defuse on that. He can push it the rifle, he's got to get the Luger frag there on the Kiji. Oh, he's got to put the place, no. but no, Kawhi's there, hiding nice. behind the door controls, and that's going to be the first stage over. And go back to the conversation we were having earlier about the stages of this map, there's basically... You could say three stages, but in my opinion, there's the first stage and then the dock runner stage. I mean, you could say that this final part where they're running through here, through the, uh, the transmitter, you could call that another stage. I mean, there's a lot of defences that will fall back to that area and defend the transmitter, wait for the uh, allies to push and make a mistake while, you know, running the docks in on their own and then uh, secure for the access, you know. It, as you said, it can be a bit random, but at yeah. the end of the day. Getting up the command post, uh, without too much opposition, they did quite well for himself. And I, I gotta say, you know, that uh, that last kill that, that was totally uh, what we call a peekaboo back in the day. <laughs> Kawhi showing us uh, he can play some serious hide and seek. Indeed, man. As uh, the Axis will set up their defense for the dock stage. Maus, another MP40 frag there, as we should all expect from uh, from Maus. I'm sure everybody's tuned in on it to be watching that guy with his, uh, let's be honest, pretty sick game. As they come for a heavy bridge push here, there's only Anthel left on the bridge. He's the right, but he's going to get one good round frag, but Yope's going to nade him down just before he manages to get over the bridge and the self kills coming from the overload side they are well it looks to me like they're going to lock this stage down i've seen them play this map before against impact when impact had a completely different lineup in uh, ec and they looked uh, they looked pretty damn good their crossfire was uh, they had a pretty nice crossfire on this stage of the map so uh, i can't see it being too good for the farmer side so what would you argue, team, team synergy versus individual skill? Is there any one player in this uh, in these players? Because I'm not familiar with these two teams, I'll be honest. <laughs> Is there any one player that really stands out for you? Well, for me, I think it's fair to say, along with everybody else, Mouse is the guy to watch. Okay. He's uh, yeah, he's the that. man with the aim. He's going to be, uh, he, you know, he's like the modern name mystic, if you like. He is, ah, he is sick. And, uh, I don't, that's a name I'm familiar with. Yeah, indeed, man. I mean... He, he is sick. I mean, you know, he's, he's the man to watch. As, uh, the famous guy is coming at the back stage. Nade from Leo, though. Is Kiji going to get the five? No, he's not, but Jerry, because Jerry's going to throw a nade at him in the face just outside the back door. Anthos going to go down as well in the docks room. And that's another uh, another attack sorted out there from the overload side. Six That'd minutes nice. and five seconds. Off. I know of the famous side, but I, I don't really know any of their players individually. So. I see. Well. We're gonna say, well, this is a good opportunity for them to make a name for themselves. So we're yeah, gonna see yeah. how they do in this map. <laughs> Indeed, there's a couple of a uh, couple of famous tracks coming in there. They are actually gonna get into the docks. They're gonna get the docks away. Kiji's gonna be the guy to take the docks and run them away as the Axis side just respawned. Mouse is looking to Mouse is looking to chase, I think, or just just check if the docks come through the spawn. It is gonna self kill, and they're gonna set up another rush. Oh, but they've secured the objective. I think Yoke managed to catch him off guard, and they've instantly uh, instantly taken the docks again. Kawhi's gonna try and jump out the window. He's gonna get away just about. 
as he was uh, getting shot out the window there, but the, uh, the, the Aptis guy has set up a little bit of a trap chain. He's going to get the Ducks carrier, but he's not going to secure the Ducks. Kiji's just going to be uh, just going to be there to save the day as he takes the Ducks all the way back to their back spawn. Self kills some farmers and a grenade almost Ooh. hitting Kiji in the face there. Jerry is on the prowl. He's going around the corner. He's chasing the Ducks, but he's going to go down to Kawhi's, uh, Kawhi's Thompson. Well backed up there from the Frenchman there. Uh, Cherry making a way through the gap at the start of the map, but there's a nice chicken crossfire from the first spawn as uh, they, they, well, they secure those ducks basically they've got them in a safe enough area you know they're not they shouldn't be able to get a they shouldn't be able to lose yep. the ducks now they're gonna have to set up a defense at this uh, at this transmitter stage like i was saying earlier is you exactly. could on it another stage you couldn't you might not be able to you know either way i think it's gonna be a state now the farmer side moving one two frags coming in there the ducks room is clear if the ducks come now they're gonna get it over and done with and they've got the ducks in there and they've there saved five go. minutes and 32 time which is it's about average really it's uh, you know could go either way but I overload are gonna win. I am sorry. They are definitely gonna win this map. They've they've they won gold rush easily. They they're gonna take this map. I see. Well, we're gonna have to see if overload uh, overload. Sorry, <laughs> overload can uh, can make uh, can make their uh, their prediction true. Hopefully they will. <laughs> I'm hoping they will. Because otherwise, I'm rubbish. I'm waiting for that warm up. This is the dead air time. Yeah, this indeed. Is this is the time, you know. Do you, do you think in ET silly. there's any mentality about warming up? Is there any advantage to warming up as a oh. ready up as the last last player? Personally, I just jump around the map. You know, okay, get well. sensitivity right, sort of like. I, I know a lot of players think that you know that's a good uh, good time to play some mind games and then yeah. you know be the, you know, everyone wants to be the one to ready up last and uh, yeah, that, that's so obnoxious. The rest is idle doing that like pattern. By the way, we have uh, we have gone live uh, on the second round of uh, Adelaide. Now, a couple of frags coming in from either side. Quake's going to get a double, actually a triple frag there. Grenade and 240 frags. Leo took a panzer, but he didn't get a mortar kill. They're not going to get a dynamite down, and they're going to sort the face rush out well played there from the farmer's side as they actually go quite aggressive on this... Uh, on the overload uh, attack here, but they are going to make their way in through the main hall now. Jerry Mouse and Cherry all make their way, but Yope is going to get caught off guard by Quake. He's going to get him killed full, and um, okay then. And uh, they are definitely going to make their way into the door controls now. He's going to prime a grenade here. He's going to prime it along with Antho, the, uh, the, the the rifle actually, who is, in my opinion, probably going to be a better, better player. I mean, he's online. So far, he's, he's performing he's, well. We only he's seen really uh, good online. Now. Seen him play so far in this map, and he's doing quite well. Oh, and yo, double frag there just to save the plant. He's gonna get that dynamite down. And uh, I want, after this round, I'm gonna put some kids in. I'm gonna see how close dynamite's are. As the engine is, do jump in now. Kawhi's gonna jump in. Absolute meta. Grenade's coming in there from uh, all around the door controls. Are they gonna get the diffuse? Jerry's gonna jump in there with a suicide nade, but they're not gonna get the engineer. They're gonna get the medic. And Kawhi's gonna prone there just in case there are any other dynamite allied team. players around. And Antho and Kawhi are gonna diffuse that dynamite. Done. Well played, Famous. Before minutes and six seconds on the board the uh, overload side they're looking strong but Not quite this, getting farmer it done side are, this farmer side are looking pretty good as well yeah, yeah i really thought that overload would uh would definitely get a get a plant there and then Indeed. actually hold the plant but uh Thomas coming back after the spawn, quite quite strong, Indeed. getting it done for their team. Thomas, they have actually got quite a reasonably aggressive defense. The dynamite gets chucked over to the door control from Yopi. He's just gonna chuck it in and make them all run in. He's gonna call, catch him off guard, one head drop frag there. He's gonna take down another one right there, and four frags there from the overload side. And uh, the fifth finally here, and they're definitely five on two. Let's. Uh Let's just put it that way. And we go in eyes with Antho now. He's uh, going to be at the top of the ramp in a pretty dangerous position here. As uh, seeing as they did self kill, they're probably going to have two come in from the transmitter transmitter area, and the rest of them are probably going to come in through the ramp room, which is here. As a rifle gets chucked down now, the spam's going to probably hit the uh, hit the ramp doorway now. But Antho's not too sure where they're coming from. There's nobody coming up the ramp yet. He's going to have a look around. Just uh, peek around this box, have a bit of a lean. When the dino, well, they're, they're, exactly, that's what I was going to say. When the CP starts getting, but he's going to pounce on him, and Jerry's going to go down. He's going to get gipped as well, and Antho is going to basically keep that CP stage on lockdown. As I, I got to say, there was some bad around. team play there by the by the Palmas team, though. Antho getting the kill and getting it done, but really, you know, that. that's <laughs> Yeah. 
online and previous LAN performances as uh, the farmers have set up quite a reasonably aggressive defence here with, uh, with a rifle in the pit and a couple of... As the farmer side, I'm not sure if they took the docks uh, or not. I think they took him and then uh, instantly instantly killed the carrier as after the rifle grenade frag on the cherry there just off the uh, on the bridge boxes. Mouse and Jerry making their way across towards the docks. They're not going to do it with the group of two. They need to rush in with the group of four or five. If they rush in with the group of four or five, they're definitely going to break this defence. And uh, hopefully the stream is definitely working for all the people watching or listening in. No, no, it was just yeah, the in-event stream. You know, they're like, oh my god, you can't see anything on the screen. What's going on? On, but no, we're good, we're good, don't worry about it. Good to hear, man. I mean, we've got 54 seconds left. Anything can happen on Adlanes. There's Mouse, he's going to make his way into the dock room. Now he's going to take on one, uh, two guys behind the window, but he's got two teammates to back him up. They're going to get the dock, and now. there's 45 seconds left on the board. Mouse is going to run him past the doorway. He's going to get a frag as well. Yup's going to back him up along with Leo, and they're going to med pack rush over the bridge. Is it going to be game over? We're going to have a peek around, see if there's any Axis players hiding around this area, you know, just to uh, cut him off. Steam? As Come Mouse on. is going to keep straving towards the uh, transmitter, he's going to make his way through the doorway. Are they going to get the docks across? It looks like they are. It's not going to be nice to uh, pass it down, but oh. Oh, quick MP40 frag. Jerry's going to pick up get the docks just in time. Oh. And they're going to get the docks back. And uh, Overlord are finally going to set a well time, played. and they're going to take this 4-0. Uh, 21 seconds. I got, I got to say, this is a lot closer than I, than I thought it would be. Yeah, usually, was, uh, usually you see this map go one way or the other, you know, one, one team wins convincingly, but uh, they're keeping it close here. Indeed, and i tell you one thing, this is weird listening to myself back mid after the cast, i tell you what, that is weird. <laughs> so now we're looking forward to the next game, which is Rocket and Spieling, I think, so are we going to stay on the stream or are we going to go to a break yeah, or what? Anyway. Are we... Sorry for the uh, the people listening in. We just uh, sorted out what save we're going to be on for the uh, next game between Speedlink and Rocket. Yeah, more ET action coming your way. Of course, this is Martin Mumbles joined by the awesome ET commentator O to the Z. <laughs> <laughs> if I might just uh, uh, quaintly rename you to that. That'll do, yeah. I've been called many things before. <laughs> Well, um, yeah, this is H2K TV live from the Antwerp Esports Festival. I hope you guys are having a good time back home. The event is uh, slowly starting to fill up uh, again after this morning was quite, quite quiet. Of course, the second day of group stage is uh, when things start getting interesting. And uh, tomorrow, we're going to see some, uh, uh, some finals. I'm, Final assuming, action, yeah. I'm assuming Narcos is some start for ET tomorrow as well. Yeah, I'm, yeah I, I do I'm believe available. so. I'm available. I'm up for it. <laughs> I want to cast some ET. So we're going to have to see uh, what kind of matches we can get. Uh, a next, uh, aside from this next match coming up uh, yeah. for you guys. Um, do we know what save we've got to be on? Uh, no, we do not. Nice. So we're going to have to depend on, uh, on the admin. We've just got to hope that. hope that the admins get us the info one time this time so we can uh, cast the entire game. Should we, uh, how about... Uh, stay on the server? Yeah, how about we tune you guys out to some music and uh, we find out the server information. We'll be right back. Uh, welcome one and all to H2K TV.